Graham. Today's hey day. Yay, hey day. Got my trusty bushcraft scissors. And we're going to cut them strings. And today is time to move the hay. <coughs> All right. Yay. Wish me luck.
But like I say, those all get bagged up for her. She loves the tops. So, we're going to take a break, and uh, I think Huey deserves a beer. It's 3 o'clock in the afternoon. And it keeps crying over, and then the sun comes out, so I'm not sure. So I don't want to get everything pulled out and put in there, and then trying to get it in the, the hay barn. I mean, if it starts to rain, I have to work faster, and she'll probably go inside. But trying to do it while she's there, she'll just want to go me. Because she can be ornery when, you know, it's like, don't take it away from me. It's like, I'm not. So she right now thinks it's her toy. So, and she's going to sit there and eat her toys. Uh, if I can get a, another shot, I tried to get a shot earlier. She was just like, holy jumping. She got tired of chewing. She actually laid down in the hay and was still eating it. <laughs> Garbage disposal, I swear. And since, what, I think that one day when I told you I was getting a day off, I already took one of these apart and I put it in the barn already. And she hasn't gone through it, it's just that to get my winter hay, it showed up early, so I need to get it in and get it stored so that I can get to other business around here. Alright, well, that's all I got so far, and uh, I'll probably do another video later, but just so there you go, let's go see Angelina, because she's actually the star of this episode. Can you say hi? Can you say hi? Say yeah, I'm awesome. Look at all your hay. Is that all for you? Chicken's digging a hole behind you. Oh, that's the rooster. So, you like your hay? Do you like it? Yeah, how's it good girl? Are you getting full? Are you getting full? Are you lay down? Well, the rooster's like, I wish she'd get full and take a nap. Alright. What are you doing out? <laughs> Sneaking out. Okay, anyways. That's my day. And then there's cat in the window, so everybody's out hanging. Oh, just a few minutes ago, Frank, tell you, turkeys come across. They come right across the front yard. They didn't see me at the hay, so they must be over on the other side where I found them this morning. Robbing me of my strawberries again, but I like the blackberries anyways. They're better. They're not ready yet, so I'll be sure to get out there and get them, but. Hey, right, thanks for watching. God bless. Keep moonshine on. Peace. <laughs> And, oh, I thought she was leaving, but no, she's coming back for more. <sighs> Savages, I'm telling you, it's all she does is eat. All right, I'm going to go have a beer. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye. see behind me. <laughs> Angelina is not happy with me, but I was starting to get a little concerned because she wouldn't quit eating. So I put her in the barn. I just took in a handful for her. Man, she was hollering like somebody was stepping on her tail. And I was like, Mom! Mom! Just giving her. She was right upset with me. But I have to because I can't have her like just pig out all day, right? So she eats too much. I mean, that's, that's not good for her. So she was just nibbling and whatnot, but every time I threw a new pile in, she felt she had to, you know, get in there and uh, taste that pile, too. So, yeah, I'm the responsible goat owner. Yes, I let her go a little bit much today, but considering that I didn't give her her lunch, and I gave her breakfast, lunch, and dinner, so today I skipped her lunch completely, and she was at 6 o'clock this morning, so I didn't start letting her eat that till 3. She's supposed to have dinner at 6, but... Tonight now, all she needs is like a cup of her fat and fiber, you know, and I give her some apple, and she's got hay in there, because I put some in there, she'll be fine, right? But, yeah, I can't let her just like binge eat, like, oh, you can hear her in the background. What? She's just mad. But, uh, yeah, I can't let her binge eat like that, because, I mean, if she gorges herself, right, she can blow it up, she can have all kinds of issues, so... But I figured, no, that was good enough. And when you put the time together, she probably only ate steady for about 20 minutes, half an hour. And, uh, but it wasn't big bites, not like when she's out browsing. When she's out browsing, like, she'll take a branch. She won't eat this, but she'll take a branch about from here to here, from out from here to the end. 
every single bite, right? So the hay and all this, every time she takes a bite of hay, she's probably only getting about that much each bite, so that's not a big deal. But yeah, I'll take you over. She gets mad. But I had to. You know, you can't wait the let the baby eat the whole cake. Alright? Otherwise, you know, they're gonna throw up or, you know, have an accident on the bed or something. Right? Like, baby, don't be mad. She's mad. Are you mad? Are you mad? She's looking at me out the window. Are you mad? Don't be mad. Are you mad? There's my little peek hole. That's how I peek in at night. Are you mad? Don't be mad. <laughs> yeah, she's mad. I have to give her like half hour to calm down. So you can always tell when she's mad. She starts doing that. <laughs> Oh yeah, because I'm not cooking anything else. <laughs>